Bromley's our dog. He's a wire-haired pointing griffon, and he's about two years old. Everywhere he goes, he just kind of radiates happiness. He's kind of clumsy. He'll be looking one way, and there'll be like a door or a cabinet this way, and then he'll hear something, and then I'll go. <laughs> <laughs> Bromley's just my favorite dog I've ever got. In May of this year, he was playing in our front yard and he got hit by a car. And broke his left front leg. The doctors thought it was a simple fracture and they said this is probably nothing to worry about. But it quickly got infected. The hardest thing is that he can't, he can't talk to us. After a lot of sleepless nights and a lot of pain the dog was in, we had to amputate the leg. It was really hard to see. You know, I dropped off a dog with one with four legs and even though one was injured. leg was amputated, it was like his muscles were all tensed up. Yeah. It was really tight. He was barely moving around the house. And I'll never forget this. The boys and I were in the backyard just to, frankly, to have fun and burn off energy. I was racing against my 11-year-old, and all of a sudden, my 11-year-old just goes down. <laughs> and Bromley had run after him and just chased him down in a playful manner. I don't know if running around just moved a kink or unknotted some muscles, mm -hmm. but after that, He's been running around and playing ever since. Every day I'm just so impressed with how much energy he has and how much he can just keep going and act like nothing ever happened. You know, our companion is back. He got hit by a car, his leg got infected, and then he got it amputated. And he's still walking and he's still trying to catch birds. Here's a three-legged dog. When I get up in the morning, he's the one pulling me outside. He's meeting me at the car and he wants to go hiking. And now you, you wouldn't know. The, the only thing that's pretty noticeable is when he goes to point, there's not a leg to point with. He thinks there is. <laughs> so far he's definitely been the one to be like, okay, I'm ready, let's go. Uh, you wanna go again today? You realize how precious these moments are when Bromley was that close to losing them. It's made every moment with him that much more special and more of something to savor. <laughs>